Yeah, it's your boy Griff here back with another video and today I got a special video guys man today we're gonna be checking a look at Green Super Saiyan 4 now since the third Andy is coming up I was like let me look back up to the second Andy units and just looking at him I would say he was the worst sparking second anniversary, uh, anniversary unit and that doesn't mean that he was bad it's just that the other ones were good and I felt like Omega Shamar was better than him even though Vegito Blue counter basically all the red units in the game, but this Omega Shenron like stats is just like his kit and everything. I feel like it's way better than him. And the other one, other the other units, I feel like it was better than him as well. But looking at his unique ability, I really like this. When he's paired up with a Sand, he restores 50 key and reduces damage by 45. So he can he has a, he comes in with a lot of key and he's tankiness. And then every time he uses a blast card, he has 25 damage afflicted and then minus for the blast card's cost. Which is really good because you don't really see that many blast cover changing units in the meta right now. You see a lot of strike cover change, which is really good. And then he comes in with a blast card as well. So 50 key and a blast card. And then he gets these other passives um, when he comes in the battlefield. And now his main ability is interesting because he doesn't come in with key like how you how other units do when they have an old card, right? So, But he does get, you know, damage afflicted, blast damage, and then increased card draw speed, which is nice. But when you pop his old, he does massive impact damage, which is pretty okay. And then does restores health by 40%. So he restores a lot of his health with his old card. But you have to land it. You have to hit someone with it. Now, green card, you can, when you pop it, you can basically combo off of it. And you get key off of it, which is pretty nice. And blast on, which is nice. And then his blue card, depending on how much blast card you have in your hand, depends on how much damage it's going to do, basically. So, yeah, I'm going to run him on the Saiyans team. I really want to run him with Kid Goku because I really like this ability right here. When he does key and damage afflicted when he switches to standby. And then the other unit, the other unit doesn't matter. It depends on who we're facing. I'm gonna show you guys a quick. We're gonna have matches to get some dubs. Let's see how Super Saiyan 4 Goku is. And I'm gonna catch you guys there. Alright, first master video facing up against the Sun Family team. He has Gohan, so. Okay. We'll go here. So we'll tap us out. We're gonna play aggressive here. Is he gonna switch? All right, nope, he doesn't switch. So we'll go here. We're actually gonna switch here. We're actually gonna make him, yeah, I want him to go to UI. So, all right, we're gonna stay with him. I'm gonna tap, see what he does. Yes. Yes, sir, team me up, team me up. This is gonna do a lot of damage. Woo, <laughs> wow, team me up, Goku. This it's not gonna take him out. Yeah, he's gonna transform. I feel like he's gonna tackle. Nope. That's all this dude is doing, bro. Got him there. Okay. Okay. I'm not gonna drop combo. Yeah, he if he gets me, he gets me. So I mean, Goku this is pretty solid. He does solid damage. I'm gonna play aggressive here. Nope. Nice. I should have just played aggressive. Okay, Gohan is here. We want to switch here now. Nice. Took him out. I'm glad that he didn't pop his main or anything, right? So we'll go here. We're gonna switch to Super Saiyan 4. See how much damage he can do against what's the name? Against UI. UI doesn't have the best damage, so I kinda wanted to see what he can do against that man. No, nope, he can't really do that much. I mean yeah, I, you know, like it is color disadvantage. So now we're just down to one person. Uh, UI, I'm not UI, but Namek Goku. Okay, what's your stars? Nice. Oh, no. Oh, I could have popped the what's the name? He got me there. No, he rides and rushed him. Nah, that's crazy. Uh, let's go green. I don't, I don't, I don't remember him using a green card this whole match. So, yep. Okay, we're gonna play aggressive. He might pop his main. Yeah, it is gonna kill. Nah, okay, we're gonna just play aggressive here. Okay, dodge here. All right, got him there. Okay, we're gonna go here. Let's pop this. Let's see how much damage this ult does. Ah, uh, we didn't even get to see it, but he did all right. He did okay. He did okay. Um, we didn't really show him that much because Namagoku just went nuts. He almost one shot at that Gohan, which was crazy. But yeah, we have three more matches to show him. So yeah, we're gonna hop into the next match of the video. I'm gonna catch you guys there. All right, 
second match of the video facing up against GP, and he has the EX baby. So it's gonna be interesting right here. We want to tap. He got me there. I know he does extra damage to Sands, so we got to keep that in note. Keep that in mind, actually. Comes in with all his blast cards. That's one thing I really like about the Super Saiyan 4 Goku, the green one, is he comes in with 50 key and a blast card. Like, that's nuts. We're going to dodge here. Okay. Basically the same as the Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan 3 Zenkai Goku, right? Like, they, he comes in with 50 key and a strike card. He basically does the opposite, which is pretty nice. We're going to just pop this so we can just get that Dragon Ball. So... Okay, see what he does here. Uh, I, thought, I thought he was gonna sidestep. Nice. All right, he's gonna go to, but okay, he's gonna go to Super Saiyan 4. Okay, basically we just need to be, we need to get one more combo then we can get our Dragon Balls. All right, he got me there. Yeah, he's about to pop his endurance, huh? Okay. Oh, he locked me in. I was going to switch out. Nice. I'm going to go here, though. That sucks that he took out what's the name. He took out what's the name. Uh, Kid Goku, but we're, we're good. I'm not really stressing about it too much. Okay, now I am. God, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to combo drop right there at all. So we're going to go here. Okay. All right. We took him out. We're going to pop the main and see what he's doing. Oh. Not doing much. That's gonna do a lot of damage though. Yeah. We're gonna rise and rush. Uh let's pop a green. He's seen us use a green a while ago, so I don't think he's gonna pick green. Please. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Now this is gonna be really important. Now I don't know if I wanna switch to I'm probably not gonna switch to Super Saiyan 3. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna tackle. Yep, I know he's gonna do that. And we got the PV there. Let's see how much damage this dude does for he does get card draw speed, which is pretty nice. All right, we're gonna go here, go to Super Saiyan 3, and this should be game. So, didn't really show him that much, and another forfeit. So, yeah, he does solid. Like, I really like because he can he can prolong a combo. Like, just that 50 key and that key and that getting you a blast card. Like, that's so valuable. The only problem is he just doesn't really do that much damage like Super Saiyan 3 Goku when he does with his strike. So that's pretty much the thing, but I really like that ability. That real that ability is really clutch. And yeah, so we'll hop into the third match of this video. I'm gonna catch you guys there. All right, third match of the video facing up again. Scott Key. Okay. Kind of hate. This is what I hate so much about PvP right now. Like so much passive play, bro. Like, and I have to play this way because I don't want to get punished. And like you see right there, like. He just farm for PV, like it, it gets annoying sometimes. But it's like you don't want to take the perfect vanish out the game because then people are just gonna be it's like whoever uses up their vanish first is pretty much gonna be done. Yep, we're gonna pop that. And that's a lot of damage right there. I feel like he has a green card right now, so I don't even want to do nothing. Yep. Okay. We're gonna go to Super Saiyan 4, see how much damage he can do. But I do, I mean, you do, have, you do have to ramp it up, right? Because every time he uses a blast card, it does more damage, which is pretty good. But we're going to go here. Okay. We're going to tackle. Nice, 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 nice. Nice. That was a good, that was a good play. That was a really good play. But at least we got rid of his, his, his main, I mean, his little vanish thing really early in the game all right he's starting to read me does he get card draw speed right now yeah now he just got it right, if he takes goku out then i don't really mind okay is he gonna rush hope he doesn't have a strike card in his hand Got him there, nice. Woo! We're gonna pop the main. See what it was doing. Do we PV him? Nah. No! I thought we had him. I thought we had him. I don't know why you did that, but okay. I would've just kept going. That's gonna do a lot, yep. Oh man, that sucks. That sucks. But 
I'm not Ryuden, you know. I'm not I'm not someone that just taps people out. Like if you got you got fainted, then you get fainted, bro. Like we don't we don't do that. We don't do that nice stuff around here. But shout out to Ryuden though. Shout out to Ryuden, but I don't do that, bro. Cause if he would have fainted me, I doubt that he would have tapped me out. So that is how it is in this PvP world, bro. It's a cold, cold world in here, you feel me? So I don't really care at all. You guys might say this is um Oh, did I dodge that? No, he got me. That I was messed up for that. But you know, you guys know that he would have fainted me. He would have he would have definitely did the combo and stuff. So And we guessed him. Yeah. I'm telling you, bro, PV PvP is a cold, cold world, bro. Like, <laughs> I can't really do much, but Super Saiyan 4 was doing really solid. Like, you definitely gotta ramp up his blast a lot. That's kind of he just he has a he has to do a lot. You have to do a lot to make him really good i feel like that's the problem like there's a lot of things you have, to, you have to really set him up to make him the most viable which is you don't want to do that you want people just to be adam like automatically strong in him it takes a long it takes him to rack up the damage right so we're gonna hop into the last match of this video i'm gonna catch you guys there all right last match of this video fixing up again sun family okay yeah gohan uh no dodge let's go i could have combo with what's the name that's what i should have done but i just really want to just show super saiyan 4 how much he can do Cause i feel like he hadn't really gotten that much love in his video he might have had but i just really want to show him out against a zenkai 7 gohan took him to half hp which is nice really good so okay Got him there. Who he does? Got him there. Perfect. We're gonna go to Super Saiyan 4 again. Once again, that 50 key in that blast card is nuts, bro. It's nuts. So I should I probably should have swapped the Namku, but now he can pop the. Yep. Now he has endurance. Okay. We're gonna go here. Right. Oh, I didn't dodge. Dang. All right. His tanking is not the best. This is like a three-star Kyle Ken. So we're gonna switch out here. But he does get reduced damage. Oh wow, he rises and rushes. I, wow. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's pick. Let's pick blue. Did he use a blue card? I don't think he used a blue card. Yes, sir. Team me up, bro. We're gonna go to Namku transform he healed wow okay i mean that's not bad but i wouldn't have done that if i was him all right we're gonna go here Ooh, nine, three, eight. oh let's go tv up tv up tv up all right we'll go here we don't have we don't have enough key so we're gonna chill here Oh my gosh, we just PV him. I feel so bad, but I really don't feel bad at the same time. So we're gonna go here. Let's go. We're gonna go here. Okay. And we're gonna go here. Is he gonna switch? No. Okay. We're gonna pop this. I'm not really scared about Gohan now since he already popped his main ability. Got him there. Ooh, TV up. Oh my gosh, let's go. We're gonna heal up and everything. That's the only thing, that's one of the downfalls about the Super Saiyan 4 is you gotta pop, you gotta like activate the old damage. Like you gotta actually hit, like make it land on the enemy for him to get his health up, as you guys can see there. Which is like most people when they pop their main ability, regardless if they don't hit the old damage, they get the they get, get they get the health restoration. So I I really don't know why they did that for him. Kinda was weird. Like you have to land the old on the enemy for him to get that, which is Kind of makes no sense but we're gonna go here see how much he can tank that's one thing i do like about him one when he was when i was using him against the vb metal bro like he was tanking against vegeta blue like he was nothing the only thing i didn't like about that matter was remember you couldn't swap out as many times as you want so once you swapped into him vb had his green card right and then he could basically I don't know, let me switch here this is annoying yeah, VV basically pop his green card and take all the way your, your your upgrades, right? So that basically took away when he pops his green, he'll take away his reduced damage cut, which was pretty annoying. 
we're gonna tap here okay hopefully this is a blast perfect we're gonna go here again and that should be game so yeah um yeah basically my thoughts on him i think he's solid i think he's solid like i said you got to do a lot to make him good like using kid goku because kid goku also gives key and at damage afflicted buffs and then it takes a long time for him to rack up his damage like i said you got to use a ton of blast cards for him to get his damage afflicted up and then you pop your main ability you get card draw speed i don't think you get key on the main too that's one thing that's one that's another downside about him he doesn't get key on his main ability which kind of sucks and then if you want to get your health you have to land the old card so I don't know they, they made him you have to like i don't know they made him do too much like you have to do too much for him to get all his all his stuff and then like his blue card depends on how strong how many blast cards he has just too much stuff but uh yeah definitely he's still solid just i don't think he would i, I think he was the worst sparking unit in the second and that's not really a bad thing it's just that's just how it is so yeah that's pretty much it with this video like comment subscribe be more growth man and i'm out peace